Hi there! I know it's been quite a while since the last update, but I've been very busy with story development. Now, finally, after seven different drafts, I can announce that we have arrived with the final storyline of our film. One of the issues that we had to tackle and solve was that if you spend a lot of time in the dreamlands, and it's the nature of the dreamlands that you don't really know if they are real or not, then it might be hard for you as the audience to relate to what is happening there. It's, it's hard to, to care about uh, what the, the characters are experiencing there, since you are unsure about the status of the whole dreamland. And so the solution was actually to reduce the time that is going to be spent in the dreamland. Don't panic, it's still going to be a dreamlands film. If we talk about numbers, I would say that in one of the first drafts we spent around 60% of the time in the dreamlands and now we have reduced it to around 40%. That's a lot less, we spend more time now in, in the real world. This leads to that we can relate to the characters and the conflicts more, it's more relatable. And the other thing is, um, we are not going to make a film that is um, taking place in the present days. It's going to take place in the uh, 1920s in Germany. And so you are going to have that classic Lovecraftian atmosphere, that mythos kind of, uh, th that kind of mythos story. And I think you're going to like that as well. Next step is to have a final screenplay ready very soon so that we can send it out to all potential partners and meet them, for example, in Berlin at the Berlinale Film Festival next year in February. So next year is going to be really decisive. This year was all about meeting, the, meeting people, hopefully the right people, and also about finding and crafting the story, hopefully the right story. And next year is going to be all about making decisions and actually, yeah, to, to get it on, to bring this project, to push it forward. Everything thanks to you. It's a long journey, but we couldn't be here. I could, couldn't do what I'm doing right now without your help. So thank you again, and I wish you all happy holidays and a happy new year. See you in the next update. Bye-bye.